Okay, this is uh, Sanctum 2. Um, it's not a new game, but it is uh, today and for the next, uh, well, two and, two and three quarter days now, it's on sale at Humble Bundle for 99p. Uh, so, it's uh, by Coffee Stain Studios, who uh, who are most famous, or oh, oh, probably most famous for Goat Simulator, which if you've never played, you should definitely check out. Uh, this is a uh, tower defence FPS hybrid, or hybrid. I don't know how you pronounce that, uh, which is why it's in the the, uh, the sale at Humble Bundle because it's a tower defence bundle. So it's a multiplayer co-op. So you see, you can invite people to join, or people can just join you randomly. Let's see from a public uh, a public server. I'm going to set it to friends only, just so I don't upset anybody. Uh, in this this uh, particular game, when they join, then I quit after I've done the video. Uh, right, so we'll go to facility, and uh, I have done something. All right, I'm not done, so I've done these one. I've done this one, the gate. So let's try it. So it has this nice uh, graphical style in the in the cut. Well, no, they're not cutscenes; they're the loading screens. It's like, like a sort of comic book effect. Uh, and then when you play the game, it's it's a pretty, uh, pretty regular uh, FPS look. Uh, you get to select your character. They have different uh, abilities and everything. Oh, that's a new one to me. The last shot deals massive damage. Anyway, I'll stick with Sky Autumn because I've played in. that character or not. I'll unlock some of the weapons. But I won't, again, I won't bother customising. Ooh, cannon, what's this? So I can equip, well when I level up I presume I can equip more towers, there we go. I can have three different towers. Uh, we can choose skins and stuff, I'm not going to be that. Right, so you can see the map up at the uh, the top left there. That shows where Ooh, the bad guys are going to come. Now I've got some uh, comrades. So, let's see. We're going to come out of here, go this way, so what I want to do is uh, let's just build a wall across. So hold down the button to build. Ow. Don't stand where you're building, unless you're on the pit. Alright, so that should, you should now see... If we look at the path, they're going to come. They're now, alright, you've seen them up, they're now coming around my wall. So I'll just... Uh, Carry on building it out. Killing off vermin. One tower at a time. So then, what I need to do is uh, put some defences on my towers. Because it is tower defence. I'm just going to put one of each. I 
can't build any more defences this turn. So let's just uh, go back to uh, right. Where do I want to go there? Not enough resources. Basically, I'm trying to make them come around the corner. Right, I've run out of I've run out of things. So I hit I hit return. Okay, get ready. And we start shooting at things. And we're going to our pace so far. So we're trying to stop them getting to the core, which is up on the map. If you can see, if you can see the map. Right. That's my first my first line of defence is down. Right, so you can see the next in the next one I've got six of those guys and five of those uh, more more solid guys. I'm trying to stop them getting to the core, which is up at the top there. I didn't use any of my guns yet. And what I'm gonna do Build a wall across so that the men basically have to walk past my guns twice, if you see what I mean. Alright, now we see there's some other coming in this way, right. So I probably should have saved some uh, turrets for this. So what I want, let's see, where are they going to come? About 25 of these, coming from over there. So. I think I'll be doing. This will do it. He's probably concentrating on that one that I did ignore the defences for. Cause I'm a muppet. And hoping my turrets can take out these guys so much. Incoming. Let's just stand in the middle there. That worked out all right. Now, where are these guys coming from? Okay, they're coming in here. So, what I want to do a little more like this way. I can't afford to build any guns. Maybe I didn't shoot enough in the last one. Oh, because I've built guns there, because I'm a Muppet. Let's recycle that one. This is gonna get him. Put one of them in there. There we go. And let's just build across here. I need to build here. Okay. Oh, 
trying. Killing off vermin. One tower at a time. Alright, that'll have to do. It's probably not optimal. Let's just stick an extra. This'll do it. Maybe I should recycle one of these guns. For this one. I'm not gonna need them. That's better. This is going to get him. That'll do. Right. Let's go, team. Let's see what that does. Oh, yeah. Attacking my gun, cheeky. There we go. Alright, so now we've got a whole bunch of people coming in. I can't Let's build there. Switch to walls. Where are we at? Wave four of eight. So you see the waves get progressively harder. Interesting. Don't really mean to do that. Not go out there. Right. Okay, get ready. Around. You're finished. Oh. 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 Ah. So let's try and get somewhere where I'm not getting owned by all these things. So far, is anyone attacking? No, no one's attacking the court. We're doing alright there. All clear for now. Excellent. So let's just put some guns down. Just in the middle. So you see, it's quite a, quite an interesting combination of uh, of strategy and uh, and shooting. It's nice that you can do this co-op. Not make 
too much effort on him, am I? Take a lot of taking out, isn't it? Right, there's people attacking the thing. Go there. Watch the car. All right, could be all over here. It's all over. I'm not just not doing enough damage. There you go. So I lost. Which, if you've seen me play games before, I don't believe this. Probably not a big surprise. I did level up though, so I might have some better stuff next time. And uh, as you can see, my uh, strategy uh, sort of failed a bit in that I didn't have enough defences around the core itself. So that's another thing I can look at for next time. So all in all, I quite like this game. Uh, I've not played it a massive amount, about an hour and a half since I bought it a while ago. I've just had so many other games to play. But it works quite well, it's quite fun. Uh, quite fun to play with friends. If uh, if you've got some friends who are into this sort of thing. And uh, yeah, for 99p, really, why wouldn't you buy it at this point? Native on Linux, 99p. A couple of hours of fun at the very least. <laughs>